Disney Wish three-day cruise. And we are currently docked at the Bahamas. Let me show you guys really quick. Luckily, it like brightened up a little bit and it's pretty beautiful today. Oh, I lied. It's literally sprinkling. I don't know if you guys can tell. It's beautiful, but it is sprinkling. So that's where you would get off and then you kind of walk on. That's a little port area. Oh man, that's annoying. It was literally bright and sunny like an hour ago but hopefully it's just a little rain maybe it'll be on and off i don't know we actually had an excursion booked today it was a little snorkeling beach day but it got canceled not due to the weather although it probably wouldn't have been that fun anyways in the rain um but it got canceled because there weren't enough people that booked it funny enough and then by the time we went to go rebook and try to find another excursion most of them were already booked so we decided we'll just kind of go with the flow today and see what we can get up to. I ended up being up until like 3 a.m. last night. So let me tell you guys what's been going on. So, oh, let's go back to the show. The show was incredible. It was so good. Elsa slayed. Tiana, oh my gosh, her voice, her voice was like magic. Oh, I should have given a spoiler warning. If you don't want to know anything about the show, then just skip ahead like a minute. So last night was Seize the Adventure. And just in case you guys didn't know, you are not allowed to film the shows. So that's why I couldn't film anything. And that's why I just kind of like to talk to you guys about it. It was a really cute show. I thought it was really cool that they like do the ship horns and the ship announcements, but it's in the show. So it's like the show is about being on a Disney cruise ship, except Minnie is your captain. And then Minnie has to go get a little surprise. So then she makes Goofy be a captain. And Goofy's dream was always to be a captain, but he didn't have the confidence to do it. So it's all about him kind of messing up as a captain and steering us to different ports. But the ports, it's like he takes us to where Elsa lives or where Moana lives, Merida lives, etc. Um, so then after that, we went to dinner and so we went to 1923 the Walt Disney side and at dinner they actually sat us with two other mom and daughter couples and the crazy thing is that both of the daughters one just turned 25 and one just turned 26 and I just turned 25 we ended up making friends with them and then we ended up meeting up with them later we all went to Nightingale's and that's where they had a 25th anniversary drink I think it's called the Jubilee by the sea and it came with the coaster it was so good and it was glittery and then we all hung out and then we all went to the silent DJ dance party and just kind of hung out on the deck but we ended up hanging out till like 3 a.m. just me and the girls and our moms that was so fun we were talking about how it's annoying when you're like 25 and you're like an adult and so there's no like kids club for 25 year olds because we're adults so like we, we made our own little 25 year old kids club let me show you the coaster though because it was so cute and i would have not known about this drink if it wasn't for my friends so it came with this little bookmark and then it also tells you how to make the drink and then here is the coaster and it's like a real like coaster a hard one and i did get to here is my little outfit of the day though. I had like a whole like bathing suit outfit packed that I may or may not change into later, but this is just my little like walking around dress and yeah. <laughs> explored Nassau for a little bit it was sprinkling when we got off the ship but then as we were walking around it actually brightened up and now it's a beautiful sunny day we do a little Bahamas haul so we wanted to get just like a few things for my brother and sister we found these cute little anklets mine is the teal one we got the black one for my sister and then I think my mom's the pink I also got this little necklace I thought it was so beautiful these are all just like cute little handmade things. So yeah, I thought it was so cool and unique. And then we just got like a little t-shirt for my brother. Oh, we went and got food at the little food court on deck. We've been loving the, I think it's Donald's Bowls, Donald's Cantina, you know, fix your own little bowls. So good. That and the pizza is just like, I could just eat that for every meal. And now we're gonna go get ready for the pool because it is a beautiful day. Here's the little pool fit. I don't know if I like this hat or this hat because this one matches better, but I kind of like that this one just doesn't have a logo. So, time to go chill. I 
I am all ready for pirate night, except we don't have our little pirate bandanas. I'm not really loving my outfit, to be honest, but I just feel like the bandana was supposed to really pull it all together. So yeah, and I do have my cowboy boots on, lol. Yeah, so I'm gonna figure out where to get the bandana, and then it's pirate night. So I don't really know what we're gonna get up to. We are eating at the World of Marvel restaurant tonight, and then they have the little fireworks at sea. So apparently they actually don't give out the bandanas anymore. And now I'm like so mad at myself because I literally have mine from last cruise and I was gonna bring it, something told me to bring it, and I was like, oh no, like I'll just save the space because they're gonna give it to us. So yeah, I'm so sad that they don't give out the little bandanas anymore, but also it's on me because I fully thought to bring mine and I just didn't. Um, so we went to the store and found these little bandanas that they sell. I don't think they're as cute as the little red ones, but it's reversible. So let's see what it looks like. My idea was to just like tie it in the back of my hair. Cute! So this side is like skulls and this side is... Oh, that's really cute too. Um, I think I need to... To tie it. Oh. <laughs> I want to do something like that. So how does that okay. work? Okay. Ready? Prepare. Night. have made some fun little friends on this trip so we decided to go say hi to them so we went to Tiana's lounge because um, we made friends with bartender Bryce shout out Bryce we love you you're amazing and so I got the drink of the day which is a sunken treasure and I don't have it with me anymore but it was like the it's like a really pretty like teal drink and then we went up to go watch the sunset on deck 11 it was beautiful beautiful sunset and then we went over to Nightingale's because the piano player Mikhailo is incredible so we had to go see him and watch his set and then there I got another Jubilee of the Sea and I got another little coaster because you know just had to do that and so now we are about to go to our dinner tonight we are eating at Worlds of Marvel which I honestly don't know anything about so let's go the beautiful chandelier is lit up red just for pirate night that's so fun Ooh, we are entering into the world of Marvel Thank you. It's got a lot of energy. Our mission is to inspire the next generation of heroes with live demonstrations of exciting new technologies. Tonight's experience is brought to you by Pit, shrinking problems and growing solutions. Oh wow. Welcome, Scott Lang and Hope Van Dyne. I just need 15 minutes to... Hi, I'm Scott Lang. Um, but you might know me as Ant-Man. And I am Hope Van Dyne, the wasp. Look, before we start, let me address the elephant in the room. I've heard a lot of chatter out there asking why I didn't shrink down, go in, and... Uh, Kill Thanos in a really creative way. First of all, gross. Secondly, it's much more complicated than that. Allow me to explain. If only we had the time. I made this. It's a swan. Adorable that you think you made a swan. Target acquired. Quantum cores are online. Prepare to push your buttons. Ready? In three, two, one. Target acquired. Quantum cores are online. 
remember, no grubby hands on the quantum boards. Lots of crumbs on your tables. Here you go. Three, two, absolutely delicious but now it is time for the party i think it's called like the pirates parlay party and then we have the fireworks so let's try to get a good spot for a little party Okay, I am back from the little 
pirates rockin parlay party so they just like sung a few rock numbers and then they did the fireworks and the fireworks were cute it was the same fireworks as the ones i saw on the dream the thing is i think there was like another little pirates show earlier in the night and i think that is the show that is different from the dream but we didn't go to that one because we were just kind of doing our own thing so next time i come on ship i'll have to go see that show i feel like what i'm starting to appreciate about these cruises is like each cruise is a different experience and so if you miss a show or you don't meet a character you're not really missing out on anything because you're just like choosing a different experience so i know that i'm not doing every single thing on the wish especially like the new things or the things that are like special to do on the wish i'm not stressing i'm just kind of having fun just doing whatever we feel like doing i also did get a new shirt and i love this shirt it is so cute but i'm just going to get ready for bed and call it a night i want to go to bed early that way i can wake up early for tomorrow which is castaway key my mom has never been to castaway key but i love the island i think it's so cute i discovered last cruise that i went that a lot of the castaway key activities happen like early in the morning like kind of like before one last time i don't think i even got to the island until like two which again i don't regret because that's just what i wanted to do or needed to do that day but this time i definitely want to get there earlier you can kind of like feel the ship moving the weather is hopefully supposed to be good tomorrow oh yeah i really feel it oh the world of marvel i didn't know spider-man came out and he like goes to each of the tables but he only like we'll stop for a second and he'll only take like one photo which totally understandable because there's so many people like and at least he's saying hi to every single person but the girl next to me she was able to get a selfie with him and then he moved on so i didn't get a photo with him but that's okay i got this like scallop pasta it was delicious i think that's my favorite food i've had so far oh and for dessert they had this like donut sundae it was so good and like it came with a little piece of chocolate that said like pim particles or something but that's been my favorite food so far so i am just going to get ready for bed and then go to bed tomorrow is a fun and exciting day and tomorrow is also the shimmering seas day technically i don't know if they're calling it that but i'm calling it that because there's like the shimmering seas reception and all the characters will be in their shimmering seas outfits again and all this stuff i'm gonna go to bed and i'll see you guys tomorrow